So you might be trying to figure out how you can go through and get turn on or off Google Gemini on your Samsung Galaxy Watch in general. Now keep in mind, the Galaxy Watch 8 is kind of the one that comes with it natively, but I believe you can always install it from the Google Play Store. So if you want to, you can go inside of your Google Play Store and you can go through and probably download the Gemini app. If not, the Galaxy Watch 8 is the one that comes with it natively. Now to get started, what you're going to want to do is you want to swipe up into your application manager and you, you want to come right into your settings application, which is right here. So tap right into settings. Then what you want to do is you want to swipe down until you find that little Google option, which is right there. So swipe down and click on the Google. Now that first option that says digital assistant, you want to go ahead and tap on it. Now, most probably it's going to tell you something like add an account or something like that, unless you already have an account there. So I will click on add an account and I will go ahead and basically bring in from my phone that I already have it connected to. So it's going to tell me to check my phone. I can go and find the phone that I have it already connected to and I'll go and sign in on my other phone. And now once you're logged in, you will basically be able to come right back into your digital assistant portion right here, tap on it, and you will see the Gemini option come up. So now you can go and click on get started and it will tell us again that we have to continue on from our phone. So our phone is just gonna get another thing and you can just follow these on-screen instructions on your phone itself. So it tells you meet Gemini, your personal AI assistant, so on and so forth. And you can kind of read these instructions, kind of, kind of continue on, just keep clicking next. It's gonna keep connecting. And it says, you know, you can use Hey Google if you want to, which is cool. I will not be using that for now. And then if you make your way back over into your Samsung Galaxy Watch, you will start to see that if you hold down this assistant button on the side, it will now open up in Gemini. So you do have to kind of hold down the top button right here, but that will basically invoke Google Gemini now, and you can just jump right into Gemini right here, which is really cool. So that's basically how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, all then.